Sombrita is going to drive us to El Salvador. Where's that, Sombrita? Wow, two months in Guatemala. Time for some El Salvador action. We're all ready to go. Got all of our stuff packed up in a bag so that we know we have everything. Just filled up the water. We got an extra five gallons in the trunk. Got nothing to worry about. Gonna be using US dollars. Bought some from the US, so we should be good to go. I'm excited. I'm in shock, honestly. I can't believe we're going to El Salvador. It seemed like going to Mexico was adventurous. And then getting to Guatemala was like, whoa. But now we're gonna be two countries away from the USA. El Salvador! You can see that hill right there is El Salvador. There's a river down here that's the actual border crossing. New volcanoes on the horizon. So here we go at the border getting swarmed by a bunch of fixers that we don't need help from. Here we go. And the time on the clock. Starting at 10, 30. Just sitting in the van and there's this guy trying to sell me some money. It's so funny, he's counting US dollars. I haven't seen US dollars in a year. <laughs> Spots on yeah, we can sleep there. <laughs> or people have slept there. Barely in El Salvador. <laughs> uh, well, it's not going too well today. We got the wrong COVID test. They take it going into Guatemala, they accept it. The border didn't work out, but I'm able to get Emily a new wheel here because I broke one of ours. <laughs> For 350 gets all and get to ride some ramps with the locals. So what's over here? Somebody die! Pinocchio! I love how you can still see the van. Okay, Good boy. Somebody's happy we went on a hike. See me, see me, see me. You like going on a walk.
Yeah. Need some water? Is that enough for you? Oh. We try to make the most of it because it didn't go well at the border today, but we met some homies, take the animals for a walk. It's just hard to find a trail sometimes to do something like that with a cat. <laughs> See how El it goes. Salvador tomorrow. Okay. Here we are at the border. Fixers, fixers, amigo, amigo. Ah, uh, wanna buy a nuevo. Ah, uh, more people today, huh? Here they come, here they come. Round two. Let's try to get to El Salvador. Time on the clock? 10.30. Got stamped out super quick. Now we're gonna do the TIP. The little lady just disappeared. She said yes, and she just disappeared. So we gave her all the paperwork, and now she's texting. Call the phone. Should be done, you know, maybe tomorrow. Yo quería cancelarlo, pero la salida temporal no hay ninguna consecuencia mala. No hay ninguna. No se El puede dar ninguna multa. Automáticamente. No, ninguna multa. Ninguna. Okay. Okay. So we finished canceling out the TIP, or I guess like temporarily canceling the TIP. But we got like a stamp that says that it's canceled, so... Show the animals. I'll go outside. say too much about the pets but so far Guatemala didn't really care that we had an expensive paper <laughs> so we'll see how that goes I mean we have all the paperwork so I'm not really worried but it might just take a little bit more time if they care about the cat and the dog we have the TIP! Man, they never asked for anything for the animals and we have gotta just drive by one last dude, but it looks like we're in El Salvador! Time, the time now, 12. So that took about an hour and a half. Not bad! Not bad, Americano. Yeah, I assume there's gonna be some checkpoints, huh? Hola. Ya está el permiso, por favor. Le hice seña, no me vio. ¿Qué? Le hice seña, ya no me vio. Sí, sí. Seña a uh, firma. Oh. oh, espero. Gracias. We got some good news back there that the situation of security has gotten much better in El Salvador in the last year since they've had a new president who checked up on the police and the military. So now we're gonna head out to a hot spring waterfall. Stop number one, El Salvador. This one I thought the road was sketchy. Oh, there's a, a bus. No big deal. Here we go, only two kilometers on this 
This sort of surface, I hope. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'll just leave the van here. It's good. Spot was really nice, but we're gonna find somewhere cozier for our first night in El Salvador and uh, splurge a bit and stay at a nice hot spring. 